a polymetal gray carbon edition always ranks high and is always a favorite. Of course, the rhodium white is just a classic. Jet black mica is another one of those classic colors. Machine gray metallic is such a wonderful color with that special paint treatment. And of course, soul red crystal as well. But there's a new color or several new colors that may be edging out the top. So which color will rank the highest or be at the top of my list for my favorite Mazda exterior colors? What's up everybody? I'm Jonathan Sewell Sales at Mitchell Mazda on the boulevard in Enterprise, Alabama. And today is finally the day I'm going to uh, break down and rank my favorite Mazda exterior colors. There's actually 17 different exterior colors available for 2024 and 2025 models. Of course, there's been some new products and new colors since the last time I did a video like this. And you know what was number one before. We'll see with these new colors, new vehicles, if it's still number one, or if it's pushed out, but the top five is really gonna be interesting. So uh, let's get started with number 17 and let's jump in. More, 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 more garbage. More, 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 more garbage. Getting started at number 17, it's the beautiful Windchill Pearl. And I don't know why it is a Toyota color only available on the CX-50. I don't know why, I guess uh, that has something to do with it, but really I just never really liked the wind chill on the CX-50. Um, it could have been any of the whites and I just seem to not like it, but it's number 17 on my list. Number 16 is an older color, which is why it ranks so low. It's the eternal blue, still available, still looking good. And even now with the painted cladding on the CX-5, a uh, little bit of new life to the eternal blue number 16 and uh, i expect it to go away or maybe get a replacement in the next year or two number 15 yes black is beautiful but it's just never really been a favorite of mine jet black mica is number 15. it is a beautiful vehicle but again this is uh, my personal opinion that black is just not as appealing as some of the other colors that are offered in the lineup number 14 sonic silver so this uh, used to be on a lot of Mazdas. Now it's only on the CX-90 in the premium trims, uh, but that makes it a little more special to me, but not special enough to uh, climb up the list. But Sonic Silver, older color, still beautiful. Number 14. Number 13, another CX-50 only color ingot blue. I love this blue, uh, but it is one that we just don't see a lot and uh, there's another blue that I value and appreciate a lot more. So this one had to land somewhere. And so it's number 13 on the list. Number 12, Snowflake White Pearl. Uh, still beautiful. Yes, I, I did break up all the whites, which may not make any sense. I felt like it was necessary to do. Obviously, the updated rhodium white is replacing it on a lot of vehicles. Uh, so it's just an, an older color and falls number 12. Number 11 is a old but new again color, the ceramic metallic. This is uh, popular or made popular and, and came back uh, from years ago in my first list on the uh, Miata only but now it's on the CX-30 and Mazda 3, only available on the Select Sport. It's not white, it's not tan, it's in between, and I love it on those with the black wheels, only because of the gloss black, I think with those trims, make it number 11 on my list. Now as we jump into the top 10, this is the newest to market crossover with uh, the newest color, Melting Copper. Only available on the CX-70, but this is one that uh, they hyped up with the ads and the marketing and wasn't sure if it'd be too orange when it got here, but it actually proved to be a beautiful color. Again, only on the CX-70 for now, but it's a very special color, something I think everybody enjoys if you're wanting something unique. So number 10, Melting Copper Metallic. Number nine is that Rhodium White metallic this is hard to tell in the sunshine here maybe we can see it more on the uh, cx-90 but it was designed with the metallic to be almost reflective uh, when it came to market on the cx well cx-60 but then the cx-90 so a brand new white you're going to see this metallic uh, white on more products moving forward so the rhodium white metallic is number nine on our list. 
Number eight is the Aero Gray, a muted lighter gray, which is reminiscent of several grays and several manufacturers. Of course, it came to market on the MX-5 Miata and looks absolutely beautiful, as you can see. But now it's available on the CX-30 and the 2025 CX-30. Haven't seen one of those in person yet, but I'm sure it'll be beautiful. And I'm sure with some gloss black wheels, it will be even more fabulous. So the Aero Gray is number eight. Number seven is another muted color, which is a love-hate. Some call it green or olive, but it's Zircon Sand Tan, the sand uh, color. Zircon Sand, of course, on the uh, CX-50 first, and then the CX-70. And I expect this to uh, be featured on more crossovers in the future, but a beautiful color a very rugged, outdoorsy color, which is why it's on the, that uh, CX-50 originally. And again, love it or hate it, it's number seven on my list. Number six is a new premium red, the Artisan Red first released on the CX-90. And I think we will see this maybe in the future on other crossovers, but for now, it's only for the uh, design for this uh, large format or large crossover and only on the CX-90, not even on the CX-70. So Artisan Red is very beautiful, especially paired with the uh, white and tan uh, leather interior. And uh, you know, it's just another great red from Mazda, Artisan Red at number six. And before we get into the top five of my favorite Mazda colors, I did want to share with you a uh, perhaps new color coming, and that is the Cypress Green that is a Toyota color available on the Corolla Cross, as you can see here, uh, but a forest green, I think would be perfect for the outdoors rugged CX-50. And this could be something we see later in the 2025 model year, or perhaps later availability on the hybrid. So Cypress Green is listed as an available color in the build specs, but obviously not yet available on the CX-50. So, Keep your eyes open for that, it may be coming soon. Starting off that top five, it's the one and the only blue in the top five. My favorite, the Deep Crystal Blue. And it's a beautiful color. Of course, I love how that metallic pops uh, in the sunlight and uh, Deep Crystal Blue breaks into the top five as my fifth choice. Number four is the wonderful Machine Gray Metallic. As we talked about before, it's, it's very unique paint treatment. And I've got a couple of CX-50s right here in the machine gray. Looks good on, especially in the sun, but looks good on every Mazda. And uh, special, special treatment, just, just speaks Kodo design. Soul of motion. This is really what that color was designed for. And it's very beautiful. It's always going to be in my top five. It may have slid down a little bit from uh, the last time I made this list but it's still a wonderful color and you can't go wrong with the machine gray. Before we jump into the top three of my favorite Mazda exterior colors, I just wanted to insert a little bit of a wish list Mazda. If you're listening or watching, we want some bright blues back. Yes, the deep crystal blue is one of my favorite, but bring back the sky blue from the first gen CX-5 or the dynamic blue from the CX-3. Whichever you choose, we'll be happy with, but give us a bright blue to come back on some of these models. Would look great on a new generation CX-5 or even a CX-50. So bright blue, Mazda. I hope you're listening. That's on my wish list. Comment down below if you'd like to see a brighter blue. Maybe even on a Miata would be fantastic. Uh, but let's jump into the top three. And this one's pretty tough to narrow these down. So stay with me here. So many great colors left to finish out this list in the top three. Uh, but our first in the top three, number three, the Platinum Quartz. And yes, this is the uh, Turbo Premium. So the gloss black, again, has really influenced my decision here. But uh, a couple years ago, I called the Platinum Quartz the best color for the CX-30 when it first came out on that trim. And I love it. Of course, it replaced the Sonic Silver on most uh, vehicles or vehicle lines. It's not a white, it's not a dark color, so it's really elegant, really premium, and the Platinum Quartz, one of my favorites, third favorite actually, is it's number three. I think you know which two colors remain, and it's hard to, uh, they're pretty close in my book, 
but I've got to go number two, polymetal gray. The polymetal gray, of course, on this beautiful Carbon Edition CX-5, which got all the attention from me as the previous favorite or the non-turbo favorite in the CX-5 with the gloss black. Unique color, of course, now we also see it on the CX-50 and uh, on the CX-70, which I love that idea with the polymetal gray and red leather for a CX-70 Carbon Edition. And what I love about it is how many shades of the polymetal gray there are. Even on two vehicles sitting next to each other, it's hard to tell that they're the exact same color. But this is my second favorite Mazda exterior color as the Carbon Edition will always hold a place in my heart. So that leaves, yet again, the number one Soul Red Crystal. Mazda sought after to make the best, most beautiful red, full of passion, and they have done it. This is the most beautiful red in the whole automotive industry. Very premium, very luxury, more love for it because of the painted cladding on the CX-5. And again, more paint is better. This on a CX-90, or in this case, a CX-70 plug-in hybrid. So more red on the 90 or the 70 uh, is, is really special. And I just love how that sun uh, reflects off of the metallic and uh, that Kodo design again is just wonderful and I, I guess I'm more of a fringe color guy reds and blues instead of the uh, white black silvers uh, and tans even uh, although that platinum quartz looks good too just the more paint the better but number one my first love is the soul red crystal uh, and how do you think i i compare to you what do you say your top five is comment that down below your top five top three or the entire 17 however you want uh, so that we can compare so there you have it all 17 mazda exterior colors ranked by my opinion and if you have any questions on the colors, the features, or any of the product lines, you can comment down below as well, or text me at 334-718-0504. I am Jonathan Sewell Sells at Mitchell Mazda on the Boulevard and Enterprise, and I'll see you on the next one.